Barry, this is one of the most stunning cars here, and I don't even know what it is. What am I looking at? I, I'm not sure I know what it is. <laughs> now, the idea behind this car, this is a one-of-a-kind car built from absolutely nothing. No plans, no diagrams, all by eyesight and up here. Really? But the idea was to have a car that has the attitude, the looks, the sound, of those great uh, Italian racers of the late 50s and early yeah, 60s. Yeah. But it has to, that look. But to marry it with state-of-the-art technology underneath. Brakes, engine, all of it. So that's the vision and that's what you created. That's correct. Wow. So we're talking tubular frame. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> hand, hand beaten uh, aluminum. All aluminum body? Yep. Unbelievable. And, and a full, I mean, all business race cockpit. Yep. All your gauges, your lights, all your lights, uh, your steering wheel, your Brony knockoffs, those are all original found all over the world, okay? Uh-huh. Uh, the tires were specially made in Belgium for this car. As their favorite? So in essence, everything on this car is handmade, whether it was handmade 50 then, years ago. Or now. Or now. How was that marriage? How'd that go? Listen. <laughs> <laughs> I called four or five coach builders across the United States. Okay? Who did it? Uh, Creative Workshop in Dana Beach, Florida. Uh, Jason Winnick and his wife Kim own, own the place. Great master coach builders. And I call around the United States when I had the idea to do something like this. Most people think you're crazy. Oh, they wouldn't even return my call, okay? <laughs> and when I got Jason on the phone, he said, hell, I can build anything. <laughs> That's my kind of guy. <laughs> so he sent me an unbelievably great proposal and writing. And I called him up two days later and said, how much money do you want me to send? And we started. And what you have to realize is it was a work in progress. The slope yeah. of these fenders, we yeah, didn't yeah. start with that. You ended up We with just it. ended yeah. up there. So how long did it take? It took uh, right at 20 months. It took a few amount of checks. Yeah, yeah. And uh, we have something here that uh, I can okay. say that no one else else in the world has. Oh, it is true. Especially. So what's the power plant? It's a BMW, a uh, big 12-cylinder engine with oh. special heads from the factory. So why'd you go Beamer? I mean, reliability, Yeah. power. I mean, this thing is a 251-mile-an-hour car. That's nice. Um, and I didn't want someone coming up if, it, if a Ferrari w engine w uh, was in it oh, it's a, it's a and replica. saying, well, that's a replica. Well, it ain't a no, replica. Ain't a replica. <laughs> well, can we look at the power plant? Absolutely. I'll go around and help you. So I just unbuckle here, right? Yep. Come on, baby. Okay. There you go. And then twist. Just twist it. Okay. And I'll pull her up. Wow. Thoroughly modern. And as you can tell, the engine is set back. Yeah, way back. So that we have a like a almost a 48 to 52 percent ratio of weight. The car weighs 2,300 pounds. Okay. How many horsepower? Throws off about 450, 460. It's a rocket ship. Yeah. Oh, 0 to 60, 3.3. <laughs> it is a half throttle car. Wow. You know. I'll never. <laughs> <laughs> but what a you know what a fascinating uh, creation story. Yeah, it really is. It's it's the car is great, but it's really about having a dream and being able to fulfill it. <laughs> and and do you do you drive this baby? No, going right. <laughs> Absolutely, I drive. That's why I, that's why I built it. Right? Yeah. <laughs> We have, uh, we have five, uh, have a uh, 96 Lamborghini uh, Diablo Roadster. We have a 55 Porsche Spider. So, so you, got, you got some toys you play with. Yeah, but this thing, <laughs> it isn't bad when somebody says, what is it? And you say, it's the only one like in the world. <laughs> and it's mine. That's, that's great. Barry, what a car, man. I, I just absolutely I love it. Glad that's you enjoyed it. Thanks for bringing it out, man. Absolutely.